Question number four. You're playing a game where you draw a card from a deck of 52 regular playing cards. You win if you draw an ace. What's the probability of winning? If you draw an ace, there are four aces in the deck, so that's four out of 52, which is one out of 13. Remember, probability is desired outcome out of the total outcome. So this is theoretical probability. And the desired outcomes, we're looking for four aces. The total number of outcomes, there are 52 possible cards. So four out of 52, which reduces to one out of 13. If we did one divided by 13, that would give us 0 0.076923, and it goes on forever, it's a repeating decimal. If we express that as a percent, multiply by 100, so that's 7.6923%. B, what are the odds of winning? Odds, kind of like probability, where we're looking at desired outcome out of undesired outcomes. It's winning out of losing. There's four ways to win, and so 52 cards take away four is 48 ways to lose. The desired outcomes out of the undesired outcomes, which is four out of 48, which is one out of 12, which as a decimal is 0.83 repeating, which is 8.33 repeating percent. C, if you bet $5 on winning, how much should you win if the next card you pull out is the Ace of Diamonds? Let's look at the odds. So the odds of winning are one to 12. So we're gonna set up a ratio with one to 12 is five to how much? You're gonna win that much. And so we're looking for X is our, our unknown. I want the X alone on top, so I'm gonna switch it with the one, right? and the 12 is going to come up and multiply the 5. You can just leave the 1 there because 1 times x is x, but 12 times 5 is 60. So we end up with x is equal to 5 times 12, which is $60. So if you bet $5 at 1 to 12 odds, you will win $60.